driving innovation in wind power, China recently unveiled this unique twin rotor floating wind turbine. Called Ocean X, one V-shaped structure can power 30,000 homes for three years. Chinese wind turbine maker Mingyang also created the world's largest single-capacity wind turbine in August last year. While not on the same scale, the UK has developed unique technology to improve wind power production and is working alongside Chinese partners. Making wind turbines more efficient is one challenge that Chinese and UK companies are collaborating on. This can include retrofitting the blades with new technology, including using aerodynamic skills honed in Formula One. Anaketa Wind Power, based in Oxford, has been working with Chinese wind farms since 2017. Chief Technology Officer Ben Wood was the head of aerodynamics for various Formula One teams. He's adapted techniques for aerodynamic efficiency for race cars to wind turbines. So this is called a vortex in trainer, mm -hmm. and um, we currently make this part in China with yep. our partners. And uh, we de developed it with them. We tested it out in Chinese wind farms on different Chinese technology, like uh, Minyang or Dongfang or Gold Wind turbines. Mm -hmm. Some of the um, flow control features that have been developed in Formula One over the years, so shedding lots of smaller vortices rather than one large one, produces more stable aerodynamics and mm -hmm. more stable uh, vorticity and makes the part much more efficient for delivering torque and power on the turbine. These pieces can improve energy output by 10%. And for Anacada, there has been mutual benefit working in China. The Chinese have learned from the European wind turbine industry. The European in industry will learn from the Chinese as well. They're strategically different approaches. And, you know, Chinese wind turbines tend to um, produce more power at a given wind speed for the same price point. And that's obviously a very attractive thing in what you'd call reduced cost of energy. So, um, you know, they're driving it forward from looking at that metric. No country can do it by themselves. You know, China's growth has shown that they're going to be a key player in this renewable space. And the technology sharing is the best way to advance the, the progress that we all need to make because time is not on anyone's side. The Institute for Public Policy Research also says time is not on the UK's side. In a recent report, it estimates the UK will miss its 2030 target for installing offshore wind turbines by 18 years unless it triples its manufacturing capacity. And it needs to hit that target if it's going to achieve its goal of getting 95% of its electricity from low-carbon sources. Creating new partnerships with Chinese manufacturers could help the UK reach its target on time.